This model kit review is of the Heinkel 162, uh, also known as the Salamander, and uh, this is a jet-powered plane, and it's a 148 scale model by Tamir. Here are the uh, dimensions, and we have um, some artwork here. And it looks like the engine will be visible. Here's the engine. Looks like a fair amount of detail. Let's have a look inside. We have some little plastic pieces. We'll have to see what those are for. Uh, here's the engine cover. And we start to see some of the engine parts for the uh, air intake, the exhausts. Here's the uh, air intake cover. We have uh, a wheel. All uh, very well molded. Here's our uh, landing gear. No flashing, no mold lines. And uh, looks like we have two of the same exact copies there. Here's our canopy, nicely molded. We really have some really good quality here on the uh, molding of this fuselage. We've got some recessed panel lines, uh, the bulkheads, looks like our cockpit floor and uh, wings. All very nicely molded. Here's uh, our stabilizer and elevator. And our tails, see here the rivet lines, these are all recessed. We've got another wheel here. And um, we've got some detail even here in the uh, inside of the cockpit. This one has most of the engine parts. There's a lot of detail here, as you can see. Lots of little pieces to put together. This is the uh, frame that's gonna hold the engine. Here's our uh, seat. Lots of additional little parts here and there. Here's a pilot, nicely molded. And looks like probably some parts for the cockpit as well here. Here's the bulkhead for the um, back of the seat. Instrument panel there. And also interesting enough to have a um, weight that comes along with that. We'll have to see what, where that goes. Most likely the nose. Here are our decals. Nicely printed. There's a lot of detail there. Here's our painting and decal guide. Let's have a look inside here. Just gives us some of the details about the plane and the engine. Here's a picture of the finished model. Start off with the uh, frame that's going to hold the engine, the engine dolly, and then we have the uh, cockpit and the seat going together. We start to put landing gear together, and that's built into the engine bay, the main engine, main gear bay. Sorry. Then the uh, cockpit's assembled into the fuselage. Other parts of the fuselage are then uh, glued in. 
and the fuselage is glued together. Then our tails put together, and our wings. And those are all assembled onto the uh, fuselage. The wheel wheel doors. Engine is then uh, put together. It looks like the engine is actually going to be made separately. And here's the engine. Lots of details here. And sort of final assembly of the last few pieces, including the canopy. So you could have the engine open if you wanted to. And painting and decal guide. I guess this is an addition to the other ones supplied. So all in all, very well molded, nicely detailed model, and uh, that's typical to me of quality.